They just don't have the experience. If I let them go to that casino, that's it. They'd be dead. I'm not letting another agent get hurt on my watch. Hard enough getting him yeah, to give up. Yeah, this was a bad idea. I'm going back. But you did it, Forsyth. Remember that. <sighs> Need to cut out the frills in the cafeteria for sure. I don't want her to know I'm here. Truffles, Otto. Regular mushrooms are just as good. I can already hear Mia complaining she can't meditate without fresh cilantro in her chimichurri. That stuff tastes like soap, Fidelo. And also, we can't afford it. Oh. I'll just have to get Sasha to give up half of his laboratory budget. I need to keep them safe. Without funding, how can I keep anyone safe? How can I find this? Ah! Our Lady of Restraint Neurological Hospital. I think Hollis said she was an intern here once. I always had my best ideas here. Let's just hope I don't run into Dr. Putz. Maybe trying to change her mind is a bad idea. No, wait. I think that is a bad idea. any bad ideas but my own. Speaking of, I gotta catch up to Hollis and try to change her mind about the mission.
Oh my god, look at the size of that kid's head! Get him to radiology, stat! Another life, Dr. Potts. Oh, please. I was just doing my job. I heard the technique you used was developed by your intern, Hollis Forsyth. Oh, uh, my <laughs> intern? <laughs> yes, yes, well, we did collaborate on that a little. <gasps> the patient yeah. will make a full recovery, Dr. Potts. All Thanks to you. Mm -hmm. And your brilliant intern, yeah. Hollis Forsyth. Why, uh, yes. Well, she has been a helpful assistant. I like the look of these. This brain has made amazing progress. Another life saved by the Forsyth method. The, the POTS method? POTS? It was my intention? That in turn merely transcribed my dictation. Oh, uh, my apologies, Dr. Potts. In fact, I was thinking of getting rid of her. Hey! I got half a mind! got half a mind to look for the other half. Something tells me it's not too far away. Good luck collecting your debts after I'm dead, losers. I move some funds around. I could postpone paying those bills, but not these. Oh. Another grant is off the table for sure. Bet the gastronauts don't have to pinch pennies like this. Where am I gonna get the money for that? What if I eliminate some meals? I could cut my own paycheck for a while. I went to school for medicine. How did I end up stressing about money management all day? Well, I just need to put those thoughts aside and focus on the children. Their safety is the most important thing. And it's not just because a lawsuit would bankrupt us right now. That casino mission would be good experience for them. But it's too risky. What if I let them go and the worst happened? <sighs> Need to focus. Only one unfathomable fear at a time, Forsyth.
If Hollis associated risk with something more positive than death, it would open her up to so many more missions. I mean, life experiences. I'll take this nugget. I don't want to bug her in her quiet place, especially when she's pondering big ideas like death and money and stuff. Wash my hands after handling cash. You don't know where those bills have been. I should really use soap when cleaning my produce, especially the cilantro. It's the only way to kill germs. Cilantro reduces the risk of digestive distress, but it tastes like soap. And honestly, I'd rather have the gas. If Hollis wants to solve her money problems, she's going to need to accept some risk. Ugh. I can't believe some people prefer open casket funerals. Disgusting. Yeah. If I let those children go on that mission, they would surely die. Hmm. That's not the change I was going for. Sure, it's fun to take risks. But what use is it? Whenever I see socks with sandals, it reminds me of my favorite German college professor. Interesting. But that's not going to help us go on that casino What if my husband starts wearing socks with sandals? Could I still love him? I just remembered how dire the Psychonauts finances are. I wonder if any of the mushrooms in the forest nearby are rare and valuable. Mushrooms really do add a savory heft to any dish. Sure, it's fun to take risks, but what use is it? I think the only way to get Hollis to take us on a mission to a casino is to get her to associate risk with money. I definitely could not handle that stressful casino mission right now. I just remembered how dire the Psychonauts' finances are. If the Psychonauts don't get some more funding soon, I'm... Well, I'm going to die. That's all there is to it. If I could just get Hollis to be less risk-averse. Yes. If I let those children, I definitely could not handle Oh my. I just remembered how dire the Psychonauts' finances are. If there was a way to connect money and 
risk. I'm sure that would solve our problems, and nothing bad would happen. I just remembered how dire this I definitely could not handle that stressful casino mission right now. I think the only way to get Hollis to take us on a mission to a casino is to get her to associate risk with money. Foraging in the woods around here, but what if I pick a poisonous mushroom by mistake? Mushroom or it's undertake risks. But what use is it? Or it's undertake risks. But what use is it? Undertake risks. Sure, it's undertake risks. But what use is it? Sure, it's undertake risks. Yes, if I let those children go on that mission, they would surely die. If the Psychonauts don't get some more funding soon, I'm... Well, I'm going to die. That's all there is to it. I just remembered how dire the Psychonauts' finances are. If there was a way to connect money and risk, I'm sure that would solve our problems, and nothing bad would happen. I definitely could not handle that stressful casino mission right now. Yes, if I let those children go on that mission, they would surely die. Yes, if I let those children go on that mission, they would surely die. I definitely could not handle that stressful casino mission right now. I just remembered how dire the Psychonauts' finances are. If the Psychonauts... Yes. If I let those children go on that mission, they would surely die. Or it's undertake risks. But what use is it? Whenever I see socks with sandals, it reminds me of my favorite German college professor. Don't people who wear socks with yes. If I let those children go on that mission, they would surely die. We really need to deal with the mushroom growth around the quarry. It's just not safe. the basement foundation inspected, but I still worry we've got something funky growing under the water line. I just remembered how dire the Psychonauts' finances are. If the Psychonauts don't get some more funding soon, I'm... Well, I'm going to die. That's all there is to it. Yes, if I let those children go on that mission, they sure it's fun to take risks. What use is it? No. Whenever I see socks with sandals, it reminds me of my favorite German college professor. What if my husband starts wearing socks with sandals? Could I still love him? Who am I kidding? If I wasn't worried about something, I wouldn't be me. It just means I care. If there was a way to connect money and risk, I'm sure that would solve our problems, and nothing bad would happen. Sure, it's fun to take risks. But what Mushrooms really do add a savory heft to any dish. Mushrooms really do add a savory heft to any dish. Sure, it's fun to take risks. But what use is it? Yes, if I let those children go on that mission, they would surely die. I 
I should really use soap when cleaning my produce. Especially the cilantro. It's the only way to kill germs. I know cilantro reduces the risk of digestive distress, but it tastes like soap. And honestly, I'd rather have the gas. reduces the risk of digestion. I should really use soap when cleaning my produce, especially the cilantro. But when you pick up wild mushrooms, you really need to clean them thoroughly before cooking. Mushrooms really do add a savory half. Who am I kidding? If I wasn't worried about something, I wouldn't be me. It is oh my. I just remembered how oh my. I just remember who am I kidding? If I wasn't worried about something, I wouldn't be me. It just means I care. Sure, it's fun to take risks. But what use is it? Sure, it's fun to take risks. But what use is it? say this out loud, but the truth is, I really, really, really just love money. Oh my, I just remembered how dire the Psychonauts' finances are. If there was a way to connect money and risk, I'm sure that would solve our problems, and nothing bad would happen. I definitely could not handle that stressful casino mission right now. Yes, if I let those children go on that mission, yes. If I let those children go on that, yes. If I let those children go on that mission, they would surely die. just remembered how dire the Psychonauts' finances are. If the Psychonauts don't get some more funding soon, I'm... Well, I'm going to die. That's all there is to it. I need to relax. All this... I definitely could not handle that stressful casino mission right now. If I let those children yes. If I let those children go on that mission, they would surely die. If there was a way to connect money and risk, I'm sure that would solve our problems. And nothing bad would happen. I think I think I just figured out how to solve all our money problems.
Hey, Teach, what gives? I was in the middle of a sweet hookup there. Guess what, kids? You all did so well on your lesson. How about we give your new power a test drive out in the field? You mean we're going on the mission? For real? Isn't that dangerous? You know what they say, Sam. Nothing ventured, nothing brained. I don't think that's what... Let's roll. Heck yes! Cool. All right. Sweet. Um... Woo! I'm so glad you changed your mind about the mission, Agent Foresight. I was nervous about bringing the children, but if you feel that it's safe, then it must be. It's crucial we find out what these delusionists are up to at the casino. With you handling tactical command, I'd say our probability of mission success has risen 35%. I'll take those odds. Now how long till we reach the Lady Lactopus? We are almost there. Agent Foresight, how are you feeling? <laughs> Lucky. Well, we're here. Using a false identity, we've secured a high roller suite to use as our base of operations. Now, children, you are not to leave the suite. Like most casinos, the Lady Lactopus has a strict no psychics policy. <laughs> Weak. Be happy for this chance to observe Agent Forsyth in action. Teacup, this is Shoehorn. We are nearing position one. I'm moving down the primary ventilation shaft, and Dustpan is approaching the front desk. Teacup, come in. Are you there? Hollis. Hmm? Oh, yes. Shoehorn, this is Teacup. I have you on visual. Teacup, this is Dustpan. I'm approaching position one. After you've disabled the side detectors and inhibitors, on your go-ahead, I'll approach the reception desk and distract the clerks. After they're distracted, I'll drop into the office and find the room number that belongs to this key. Just make sure to disable the main fan, because my position is close. No need to explain, agents. You do your job, and I'll do mine. Let's keep radio silent so I can concentrate. Understood. Roger that, teacup. Dustpan out. <gasps> Rasputin, don't sneak up on me like that. Listen, do me a favor and run up to the jet, will you? I need my dowsing goggles. I left them on my seat, I think. You wanted to be on a mission. Now here's your first objective. Fetch my dowsing goggles. Okay, but hurry. Our window of opportunity is closing. All right, I'll be right back. You sure you should be making drinks? Agent Forsyth is right over there. Rasputin, we're just fooling around. Lighten up. Actually, I did eat one of those pickled onions, and I think I got a little buzz off of it. Yeah, those boys are pretty ripe. What are you doing in there, Sam? When Agent Forsyth finally blows, this will be the only safe place. Everything's good on the mission so far. You mean except for our mission commander having a total breakdown? It's not a breakdown. She's just strategizing. Uh-huh. Gisu, shouldn't you be getting ready for the mission? I am getting ready for the mission. Gisu, shouldn't you be getting ready for the mission? I am getting ready for the mission.
What you doing, Morris? I'll tell you what I'm not doing. I'm not watching the pre-semi-final practice vote to find out who's maybe not going on to the next round of Pop Gladiators. I don't see any dousing goggles anywhere. I mean, to be fair, I have no idea what they look like. I've actually never even heard of dowsing. Oh no. Agent Forsyth, where are you going? Oh no, Hollis, what did I do to you? Rasputin, is that you? Mia? Sasha? Agent Forsyth is missing, but don't worry, I'll find her. Hurry, Rasputin. We're in big trouble here. Yes, please find Agent Forsyth right away. I don't know how long I can... Hold on! Oh. I'm on it. Did Agent Forsyth say where she was going? She just said she was going to solve all of our problems, once and for all. That's not ominous. Who says that's ominous? Nobody thinks that's ominous. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I can't go into the hotel. They have anti-psychic detectors. Hollis must have some way to hide it. Alert. Weak psychic activity detected. Weak? this way. Truman sees all the money I'm going to make. Hollis, wait!
Mesdames et Messieurs, faites vos jours. Ladies and gentlemen, place your bags. Don't worry, Agent Forsythe. I can fix this. Mesdames et Messieurs, rien ne va plus. Ladies and gentlemen, no more bets. different. But maybe it's not so bad?
ancient foresight? You in here? Oh, I don't like this one bit. Hollis had a spontaneous change in her worldview, unrelated to my inappropriate meddling with her thoughts. Who am I kidding? I need to find Hollis's quiet room again and break that bad mental connection I made. Uh... uh yeah, mind stepping aside, buddy? This is an emergency. No, you don't mind, or like a general no to me existing. Here we go. Ah! Oh no. 
know. Looks like Hollis had a spontaneous change in her worldview, unrelated to my inappropriate meddling with her thoughts. Who am I kidding? I need to find Hollis's quiet room again and break that bad mental connection I made. Uh... uh yeah, mind stepping aside, buddy? This is an emergency. No, you don't mind, or like a general no to me existing. Stock up on side pops. Hospital, so, uh, your ghosts don't have to walk very. Oh, never mind.
everybody. Deal them in, stacked. <laughs> Come on, live, damn you, live! <laughs> Full recovery! You did it, Dr. Potts. Call me Jack. Let's go for double or nothing. Woo! <laughs> I'm so sorry, <gasps> Doctor. Ah, oh, well, it can't be helped. Some patients are just bad luck. <gasps> I don't like the look of these. Hmm. <gasps> yes, the heart's salvageable, but the rest? Should we fold? No. no let's hold the eight and the queen. <gasps> we'll pull for the inside straight. Just quickly pop into Hollis's quiet place and fix this mess. High Rollers Lounge? That's not good. Oh no! Rasputin, what are you doing here? Sorry, I didn't mean to crash your hospital. Casino. Oh, everyone's welcome in the casino. Without gamblers, how else would we make any money? <laughs> <laughs> no, you just can't be up here because it's the High Rollers Lounge. Wait! Agent Forsyth, I need to tell you. Ah! What the? Just the morgue. Huh? Yes, Rasputin. Uh, we got a patient here. Needs emergency access. 
Sorry. The table minimum in the High Rollers Lounge is, uh, three gazillion dollars. What? How much is a gazillion? More than you got, kid. <laughs> Open up! My patient is dying! He needs fancy drinks! Stat! In my opinion, your patient needs an emergency dose of three gazillion dollars. <laughs> Open up! My patient is dying! He needs fancy drinks! Stat! In my opinion, your patient needs an emergency dose of three gazillion dollars. 